some tools are so simple that you might not think they could be dangerous. As you know, gear pullers are made for removing gears and bearings from machines, nothing else. To get the job done right, you have to use the largest jaw puller that will fit. Now, if you can, use a three jaw puller and always use legs that are no longer than you need them to be. Another tool with one use and one use only, that's a C-clamp. It's used to hold your work in place and that's it. Never use a C-clamp to pull or lift an object. It's for holding things still, not moving them around. If you want to pull or lift something safely, try an eye bolt or a hoist hook equipped with a safety latch. Now always make sure to cut off the power first if you're working near electricity. Then inspect your C-clamp to make sure it's in working order before putting it to work. And if it's showing signs of wear and tear, replace the screw or the pad or the whole thing. Otherwise, your work could slip and you may get injured. Apply your clamping force perpendicular to the work surface it's securing. Then fully engage the pressure pad and the anvil. Once you've made sure your work surface is secure, you can get down to business. It's pretty straightforward. Always use the right gear puller for the job and a three jaw puller when you can. Use C-clamps to hold your work in place, not to hoist or move an object. And always inspect the tool carefully before you use it.